JJ, back to back wins. Congratulations. How do you how do you feel after that one? Yeah, I thought we was in control all game. Um, obviously, the new signings uh, done well again, but everyone, you know, from um, KP to uh, to the big man up front, you know, I thought everyone put a shift in. Um, there's loads of togetherness in there. Everyone's fighting. Took our goals really well. Maybe should have had a couple more. I thought their goalie made a couple of good saves, but um, yeah, they're, they're a good side, and uh, yeah, it's. Uh, it's uh, definitely a deserved win. And the manner of it must have impressed you. Not only was it a, a, good, a deserved result and a good one at that, but it was a, a fine team performance in the end, wasn't it? Yeah, I'd like say, so, yeah, everyone put a shift in. Um, I think uh, we're finding uh, our, how Jordy plays and, you know, we give him the ball early, and uh, but also he can dig in for the team, so he's a team player and, uh, you know, it's the, the big man's done a shift for us again today as much as he can. Um, and he's getting better and better, but he's helping people around him. And um, yeah, it's just an overall really good day. Not that it ultimately mattered, but we're we once again speaking about the amount of chances we had. I mean, even before the two goals, I think we hit the post three, four times yeah. maybe. And like you said, the keeper pulled off a few yeah. good saves. I mean, that must please you. I know they're not going in, but it must please you going forward. Yeah, no? definitely. I mean, uh, the, the 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 chances are coming. Uh, I'll never uh, you know, point the finger at people missing chances who got me there, but um, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if KP scores, and obviously. Mass or whoever, you know, we're just happy at the minute the position we're in uh, that we're, we're getting the win, uh, and that's six big six points this week, and um, we go into next week with a lot of confidence. I'm intrigued by your programme, though it's pre-game. You talk about the man alongside you, Mass McDonald. Uh, just looking at each other in, in his eyes glaringly. But um, you know, he won't get the headlines, but he, he puts a shift in. I don't want to raise him up too much because he's standing in front of me, but yeah. he, he puts a shift in for 90 minutes, and he really makes a difference, doesn't yeah, he? Yeah, since he's come in. Um, Obviously, he's matured a lot. Um, he was he's helping the young lads, which probably some of the older players when he played helped him. Um, so he's doing that. Um, yeah, like I said, the program notes were just a bit. You know, it's not always about scoring goals. It's what he has to the team, and he will score. But you know, he's adding, he's talking, he's getting hold of it, he's helping. The boys love him, and he's been brilliant for me. So um, obviously, you know, he will say himself that he's probably played a lot below his his levels over the last few years, but. Delighted to have him, he's getting fitter and uh, as the season goes on, uh, you know, we'll, we'll keep improving. And Mass, over to you briefly, you've been here for a couple of weeks now and how does that feel to you hearing that from your gaffer? I like the the trust that Jeffo has mm. in me. Um, I've been, I've played with quite a few managers, I've been at a few clubs, but my relationship with Jeffo is a football one and it's a personal one. Um, and he knows how to manage players and I think when, you, when you're a manager, your man management skills have to be there as long as as, as well as the tactical part, and I don't, I don't think I've ever come across a person who's said a bad word about mm. Jeffrey. I'm just being honest. <laughs> How much is he paid you to say that? Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. JJ, back to you. Sorry, we we have back to back home games with just six points, and now we go back to back away, starting with Bamber Bridge on Saturday. We've spoken about our home form. Is this now important to move forward to yeah, the away? Sure. Yeah. yeah. Um, well, it's a, it's a game that we're, um, you know, like I say, we're going with confidence. Um, and you know we're going there to win. You know we're not going there to maybe, you know, as deficit sound against Mars, we would take a point, but we're going there to win. I'm sure they will. Um, we've got a few injuries that we've got to, uh, you know, look after the boys within the week. Our physio is doing a good job with that. But um, yeah, we, we, you know, is it seven defeats away? Mm. Yeah, it's unacceptable. So we've got to, you know, look at that. And um, yeah, I, like I said, I said before the game to the lads that I'm really confident. It's really relaxed. Um, you don't need to talk too much, you know. They know their jobs. They're, they're, they're you know, setting standards for each other. But um, yeah, away form's got to improve, and uh, I think it will. We will speak to him in a minute. But a final word on Jordy Hallam. That's the three and <laughs> three and two now for him. Um, the ball. <laughs> <laughs> but no, it's three and two for him. Uh, you said when he signed that you brought him in to score goals, and yeah. he's repaying your faith in him tenfold, isn't he? Yeah, he's a, he's just a quality player. Mm. Like, but, you know, you can have a technical player like that, and. Uh, Ask him to chase and get on the end of things, but he needs the ball to feet, and uh, that, that's what we try and do. Uh, and we give him the ball, and uh, that's that's what it does. But he, not just his goals, you know, like he's he drops in, you know, he's strong, you know, puts his foot in. Um, he wants the ball in tight areas, and uh, you know, as, as the weeks go on, obviously, um, you know, we'll be giving it him more. But obviously, other teams will be trying to stop him. But I think he thrives on them challenges. But um, yeah, different class. Uh,